environment in Brazil at the beginning of the 80s, it was really, really a new issue, a new political issue. As a biologist, of course, I, I'm a scientist. I'd like to be a scientist. I remember this uh, 30 years ago. And uh, I remember that it was completely fascinating to, uh, to investigate, to know more about the secrets of life. And the challenge is how we can put all the agendas, social ones, uh, the deforestation, climate change, biodiversity, regional development, infrastructure, energy generations, everything together, and uh, identifying the stakeholders, the new stakeholders, and how we can mobilize people to protect and to, to promote uh, development, regional development. This is not easy to put in practice, but uh, I think that today the Minister of Environment in Brazil to have the political conditions to move forward and to be proactive, to have the leadership, uh, and this is completely different than that in the past. Brazil today plays the most important role to reduce uh, uh, emissions of CO2 gas in the world. I think that uh, today Brazil uh, will have really good experience, not to consider our past, but consider today in the perspective for the future. And you can share this, and you can improve the South-South cooperation. You can learn with the other countries. And I would like also to highlight that in the last 20 years, you have also a change from the behavior from the private sector. The business sector in Brazil today is looking to put in practice sustainable development as part of the business. Because environment is a hot issue for our development. Brazil uh, is a, have a high rate of urbanization. And it's important to talk or to discuss with people what environmental quality means and what uh, welfare being means in our society. And for this, we need to develop new tools for the dialogue with young people. I don't believe that you can have a huge democracy without young people being on board. We have Hill Plus 20 conference and, uh, and the outcomes, they are so ambitious. One year later, uh, I'm here with this uh, award. For me, it's a, it's a non-arena challenge and uh, a clear message that I cannot be retired.